Hello guys, my name is Nahex Gaming and today we are going to talking about should we summon on this new character Legends Limited Android 17 or not. So first of all they just rebuilt uh, quite minutes ago so like we are very disappointed at this because we never anticipated this Legends Limited character. We were uh, anticipated Legends Limited hit or a castle because we just got a hint of Android EX so um, like this is the worst character of 2023 because uh, I don't think so this LF is going to be that much of good to use or not so um, if we can see the animation and uh, just this is not good at all like you can just watch here like uh, so um, this EX Android 18 just like they just copy everything from a normal Android 18 and th just they copy paste it this th that's the thing they did and the Legends Limited animation like this is like we never imagined it like this is so worst and um, like they could have just at least tagged it so that we can summon but I would recommend you guys do not summon on this banner because it's not worth it and even they didn't give us that much of events after the legends festival has ended um, uh, we all spent our crystals in this Gogeta blue so I would recommend you guys do not summon on this banner because I, I think they might give us an uh, LF that is going to be hyped for the next month um, I hope so like the previous year and I would like to say this is the worst Legends Limited so far um, I can see because the last we got Tag VT that was at least that was average that was kind of use of but I don't think so this is, this is going to like hold the meta for long uh, people will still use Gogeta Blue and the Beast Gohan for the meta as far I can see there and in the meantime we are going to get the stats of this Legends Limited Android 17 tomorrow morning uh, uh, before we see it, so I hope so and I don't think this character is uh, good enough to be in the meta or else I I don't recommend you guys to summon just don't summon just save your crystal for the next LF that's what I can say um, and if you guys are pay players then you can go for it absolutely but uh, for if to be this I do not recommend it. Do not summon on this banner. Not even a single rotation. Don't go for a single rotation because that's not worth it. Um, eight percent shoot. That's not worth it. Uh, so that's my recommendation. And in the meantime, uh, you can save your crystal. Let's see what events we get to farm off. And if you guys wanted to. Uh, know how to farm at least 5k corn crystal in these two weeks I will give a tutorial about it because I have a trick that we guys can get 5k CC in the two weeks and even they are going to drop some new events uh, to from tomorrow so let's hope we get some new events and some chrono crystals to farm off and if you guys want to summon on this banner, you like this character so so much, then you can go it for your collection. But not um, uh, if you're just going to play this for PvP and just from, uh, want to farm the uh, PvP and just top 10 gear to rank, uh, then you guys don't summon on this banner because uh, in the next month we are going to get a new LF that's going to be, I guess that's going to be hype because lots of users going to complain about it that they don't like this LF for this right now and we all anticipated a good Legends Limited character for the startup of 2023 that's why I say that this character is the worst LF of 2023 startup and let's see what we get tomorrow so if you guys haven't subscribed yet, do subscribe, like this video and comment below your opinion.